there. For our math lesson today, we're going to talk about exponential growth and decay. We have three types of exponential functions, which is the growth, decay, and neither. But in this lesson, we're going to talk about the growth. The growth is a function of the form y equals a times 1 plus r to the power of t. Growth occurs when a or r are greater than zero, or some words in a word problem, like increases or more than. Let's take some examples about the growth function. Identify exponential growth. Determine whether each table represents an exponential growth function, an exponential decay function, or neither, b, x, and y. As we can see that the x and y values are increasing, the x values are increasing by adding 1, like 0 plus 1 equals 1, and the y values are increasing by times 2, like 5 times 2 equals 10, and that leads us to the growth. Because growth equals increasement. Let's take another one. The inaugural attendance of an annual music festival is 150,000. The attendance Y increases by 8% each year. Let's solve A first. A. Write an exponential growth function that represents the attendance after t years. The initial amount is 150,000 and the rate of growth is 8% or 0 0.08. We're going to substitute 150,000 for a and 0 0.08 for r and then we're going to add. After we add all the exponents together, the festival a total attendance can be represented by y equals 150,000 times 1.08 to the power of t. Question B. How many people will attend the festival in the fifth year? Round your answer to the nearest thousand. The value t equals 4, which represents the fifth year, because t equals 0 represents the first year. So we're going to write the exponential growth function as we did at a, then we're going to substitute 4 for t. We're going to use a calculator to help us find the answer. About 204,000 people will attend the festival in the fifth year. Now it's your turn. You've learned how to solve exponential growth functions. Try to solve this one and send some pictures to the teacher. Hope you have a great day and thanks for watching.